Welcome to ZenBasket. In this video, we will see how import and export logs function in your store. ZenBasket utilizes import and export functionalities for bulk data transfers, allowing users to upload or download product information in the form of Excel files between the ZenBasket store and local drives. To get started, go to the Logs menu in the control panel and click on Import and Export Logs. Two tabs get displayed, Import Logs and Export Logs. The Import Logs shows the list of all imported data with details like module name, description, the date, and time of import. You can search for a particular module's import details using the search bar. To filter the list based on date range, simply click on the Custom Date Filter option, select a date from the calendar, and then click on the Apply button. The logs shown will include imported logs that fall within the date range you have selected. Let me show how the import logs work. To import data, go to Products Main Menu and select Brands Sub Menu. Click on the Import icon. Download the SAML template, update the changes, and save the file. Now, click on Add File button, provide a description, browse for the file, and then click Upload button. The data will be imported successfully. Click on the close icon. To view the details of the imported data, go to the Logs main menu and click on the Import and Export Logs sub-menu. The Import Logs tab displays the imported details. When adding a file, if a description name is provided, it will be displayed in the list. However, if no description is provided, it will be shown as not available in the list. In the case of errors, when you click on the eye icon of a specific log, you will find details such as the error count, module, and created on date of each log. The time and error message associated with the import error logs will also be listed. If there are no errors in the import logs, the page will display no error logs found. Click on the back button. Select the export logs tab. It shows the list of all exported data with details like module name, description, the date and time of export. To filter the list based on a date range, simply click on the custom date filter option, select a date from the calendar, and then click on the apply button. The log shown will include exported logs that fall within the date range you have selected. Let us see how export logs work. To export data, go to Products Main Menu and select the All Products sub-menu. To export the data, click on the Export icon and select your desired export option from the appearing dialog box. For instance, if you choose to export all the data on the current page, just click Start Export. Subsequently, the file will be downloaded in Excel format. The Export Logs tab displays the exported details. The previously selected option will be displayed in the description field in the Export Logs. If any error occurs during the export, you can view the error details by clicking on the eye icon under Actions. If there are no errors in the export logs, the page will display no error logs found. That's all you need to learn about import and export logs. To know more, visit our help article. Make sure you like, subscribe, and get notified so you don't miss out on any of our future videos. Let us know if you have any queries. Thanks for your support.